Hello, welcome to the Bible Takeaway, where you can expect to snack on the who, what and when of a particular Bible filling. This is a Bible summary of Daniel. Daniel is another example of a book written during the time of exile in Babylon. It's the story of four friends who are faithful to God during the exile in Babylon. The book also contains some of Daniel's prophecies. The key people in Daniel are Daniel, Shadrach, Meshach, Abednego, Nebuchadnezzar and Darius. For a key passage, try Daniel chapter 3 verses 14 to 18. And Nebuchadnezzar said to them, Is it true, Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego, that you do not serve my gods or worship the image of gold I have set up? Now, when you hear the sound of the horn, flute, zither, lyre, harp, pipe, and all kinds of music, if you are ready to fall down and worship the image I made, very good. But if you do not worship it, you will be thrown immediately into a blazing furnace. Then what God will be able to rescue you from my hand? Shadrach, Meshach and Abednego replied to him, King Nebuchadnezzar, we do not need to defend ourselves before you in this matter. If we are thrown into the blazing furnace, the God we serve is able to deliver us from it and he will deliver us from your majesty's hand. But even if he does not, we want you to know, your majesty, that we will not serve your gods or worship the image of gold you have set up. In summary, chapter one. Nebuchadnezzar brings the young nobles to Babylon. Daniel resolves not to defile himself with the king's food. God gives him wisdom. Chapter 3. Shadrach, Meshach and Abednego will not worship the gold statue. Nebuchadnezzar throws them into the furnace, but God protects them. Chapter 6. The satraps urge Darius to sign a law against prayer. Daniel prays to God and is thrown to the lions. God closes the lions' mouths. Chapter 7. Daniel sees visions. I saw four great beasts. The Son of Man was given an everlasting kingdom. The fourth beast shall be destroyed. Chapter 9. I read the book of Jeremiah. I prayed, Israel has sinned. O oh God, forgive. Gabriel says, Seventy weeks are decreed for atonement. Chapter 12. There will be a time of distress. I said, how long? He said, time, times and half a time. These words are sealed until the end. So what's the takeaway from Daniel? We can trust God even when it makes us unpopular. He is directing the big picture of history. Now, a quick quiz. Question one. What did Shadrach fail to worship? Question two. In which chapter are the three thrown into the furnace? Question three. Other than Nebuchadnezzar, which king is mentioned? Question 4. How many great beasts did Daniel see? Question 5. How many weeks were decreed for atonement? 
And question six: How long will there be distress for? Time, times, and what a time? And here are the answers. Shadrach didn't worship the gold statue. And the furnace is fired up in chapter three. The second king mentioned is Darius. The answer to question four: Daniel saw four beasts. In question five: There were seventy weeks of atonement. In question six: It was time. Times and half a time. Thank you for watching. Until next time, goodbye, and God bless.